there is a record in ancient times. It's called a Vedas, perhaps you've heard of it. <laughs> that was written by the seers. Why did they call them seers? Rishi. Rishi means seers. Because they perceive something that other people could not. So we said, he sees. He sees something. He's a seer. <laughs> so obvious, no? <laughs> and these seers, these, these advanced yogis, left behind some, you could say, our spiritual heritage, some truths for us to examine. And remember, when they call them truth, 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 to the capital T, truth for us to examine, they never expect you to take it at face value. Because taking it at face value doesn't mean it's true, it simply means I'm gullible. Instead, you have to ask, is this really true? Is this really something? And if it is so, can I see it, perceive it, and experience it for myself? Christopher Columbus went in search of India. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> he went in search of India. And they thought he was going to go, right? <laughs> Ordered the. What, 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 what ship it was? <laughs> yeah, the boat, exactly. Ordered the, the, the ship. And he says, I believe there's something out there, I'm going to go see it. And he said, say. And I'm sure when he found the place and he went back, he's like, you all, there's something over there, you know. You all should go see it. I'm sure people were like, mm, I don't know if there's something there. Let's go check. So they bought the same ship and they, they, uh, they go down. Imagine they were willing to do this in the ancient times. If you see a sign with wet paint, you have to touch it to check. You can't even read the sign and say, no, it's wet. <laughs> So, we all have this innate desire to see and experience it for ourselves. We are not satisfied to have people tell us. We are not satisfied. It might satisfy us for a time, and then we will begin questioning. We will say, what is that? So, this Agya Chakra awakening is about learning to see. Learning to see. Learning to perceive things about ourselves, not something outside, about ourselves. It's about trying to perceive the spiritual truths that have been handed out to us. To try and understand, is it really true? Because if, if I just accept it at face value, I receive no fulfillment from it. It might placate me for a time, but then eventually I become restless again. So these spiritual truths is what the Agya Chakra is really looking for. That's the function of the Agya Chakra, to help you be in tune with the spiritual truth.